shown in front of you in this figure that this this is the atom and this is the energy level the main energy level here there are three main energy level but as we said before they are seven and the energy level take the symbol k l m n o p q they are seven okay after that scientists had discovered that each main level contains definite number of other levels called energy sublevels. What are they? The sublevels? S, P, D, F. Sublevel. S, P, D, F. Then they reclassify the elements in a table known as the modern periodic table. And the concept of the modern periodic table are classifying elements according to their atomic number and the way of filling the energy sublevels with electrons. Okay, let's have a general look to the periodic table and try to describe it. We have in the, in the periodic table, 118 elements, 92 are available naturally, but the rest are prepared artificially. Okay, this is general lock to the periodic table. The periodic table consists of four block elements. S block elements, as you can see here, P block elements on the right side, D block elements in the middle, and finally F block elements. Let's take every block element and talk about it briefly. Okay. One, S block elements. S block elements, they are located in the left side of the periodic table. And they are arranged in two groups. A1, 1A, and 2A. That's all. Okay, the next. P block elements. P block elements, they are located in the right side of the periodic table and they are arranged in six groups. Let's see 3a, 4a, 5a, 6a, 7a and group 8 or zero group that includes as we said before the inert or the novel gases. The next yeah that's right D block elements. As we can see in the periodic table here in this figure, D block elements, they are located in the middle of the periodic table. Starting from the period number four. Let's count with me. One, period number one, period number two, period number three, and period number four we can find the block elements. And they are arranged in 10 groups, taking the sample B. 3B, 4B, 5B, 6B, 7B, 8, and take care, 8, Eight, eight, one B and two B. You can notice with me when I mentioned group number eight. We can notice that the group number eight doesn't take a symbol B. Why? 
I tell you. Because group number eight consists of three vertical columns, let's see, three vertical columns. These three vertical columns are all group number eight. The, so they can take the symbol B. Okay, why? Due to the similarity in properties. Let's have, let's talk about F block numbers, F block elements. As we can see, F block elements are blue, the periodic table, and they are include the lanthanides and actinides. Okay, as you can see, why F block elements are below the periodic table, not inside the periodic table? No, why? Because this huge number, عددهم كبير جدا فما نقدرش ان احنا نحطهم هنا لو حطيناهم هنا ال ال هيوسع جدا ال periodic table مش هنقدر ان احنا نلمو فاختصرناهم في مجموعتين سميناهم lanthanides و actinides وحطيناهم below the periodic table. Okay. Now, now dear students, let's watch a video showing us the electronic configuration of an atom. As you can see here, this is the nucleus. And we have here protons, neutrons, electrons. This is the symbol of the atom. <clears throat> if we take one proton from here, not with me, Okay, one protons. So the atomic number will be one. The symbol is H hydrogen. Okay, the atomic weight two. So neutrons are one. If I can configure the electrons outside the, uh, the atom in the energy levels, we can distribute it outside as you show okay again let's see it again come with me oh we have here two protons so i have different element was it was h e helium with atomic number two and the atomic weight four so I have two neutrons. Okay, and what number of electrons? Two. I will distribute two electrons. Okay, not me. Notice that with me. If I have the electron in the main energy level number two, la the electron is not going to enter the main energy level number two. Why? I have to first bamla the main energy level, the oriyb, and then the bariyb, as you can see here. Okay. كده عملت distribution of electrons in main energy level number one. Okay, element H E helium with atomic number two and atomic weight four. So it has two neutrons only. Think with me. If I have three neutrons here, but the same atomic number, and I have a helium at five, isotope. Excellent. Here we have atomic number three, so it is a new element, lithium Li three. The, elect the electronic configuration, as you can see. Okay, dear students. Now, the next point is how to locate elements in the modern periodic table. لو أنا اديتك تيبل اديتك أنا عاوز أعرف 
the location of that element. يعني period number كام which period and which groups that the element located. Okay. So you have to remember that. The atomic number equals the number of protons equal to the number of electrons. Remember that well. Okay. Remember again, the number of electrons which saturate the first four energy level, K, L, M, N, can be calculated by the relation 2N by 2, which N is the number of the energy level. K equal 1, L, well, 2, M, 3, N, 4. Okay. Remember also that the element period, period number, I shall not give the number of period. The element that I give a name, Arafus day, the number of energy level. So the element period number equal number of energy level. Don't mess it. Remember too. The element group number equals the number of electrons in the outermost energy level. Number of electrons اللي موجودة في مستوى الطاقة الخارجي هي اللي بتقول لك الجروب نمبر كام. لو مستوى الطاقة الخارجي the outermost energy level have five electrons for example so the element group number will be five. And you can identify 5b or 5a and so on. Okay. Remember, the atomic number is an integer number. Okay. And it increases from an element to the next element in the same period by 1. And I bazid from element to the next element in the same period bazid بواحد بس. بما إن عندي الأتوميك نمبر بتاع الألمنت is integer number so scientists cannot discover new element between sulfur 16 and chlorine 17 for example also I can ask you why you scientists cannot discover new element between carbon 5 and boron 6 sorry boron 5 and carbon 6 Okay, because the answer, it will be because the atomic number is an integer number. It increases from an element to the next element in the same period by one. Okay, this is a game. You can uh, solve it uh, by yourself. دي عاملة زي السودوكو كده حاجة يعني for fun. تسعة مربعات. وكل مربع فيه تسعة مربعات صغيرة احنا عايزين نملى كل الجابس دي ب elements اللي موجودة تحت دي as a game for fun uh, زي السدوك Okay dear students uh, I'm most very happy to be with you today in this lesson uh, I am teacher Mary Maurice. If you have any any question about anything, I can reply to any time. Okay. Goodbye and see you see you soon.